So here's so a web page I made in Spark page, and let's say I want to share this with other uh, users. So the way to share it is by pressing on the share button right here. And here you can even print uh, the web page. So this is an unsupported browser. I'm using F Firefox, so you have to use Chrome for this. You can also invite people to actually view this web page. So the most common way is to publish and share the link. So once I click on this, it gives me option to publish uh, my web page. So you can see that over here I can give it a title. So over here I'm going to say to the tube and I'm going to say test. This is going to be title. I'm going to pick a category as education and I'm going to turn on the author and I'm going to name this as to tube. I'm just going to remove the last name right here. Here you can also add in photo credits as you can see right here. Um, and according to what I actually imported, it added in photo credits in itself. I can also add in custom uh, cap, uh, custom credits right here. So custom credits, I can simply say this, and I can uh, get notified uh, when this is featured on Adobe Spark website. So once I'm okay with everything, I'm going to click on create link. So it will create a link for me. And once it's created the link, you have the share options right here. So this is the shareable link. I can copy this. And uh, if I were to go over here and paste this, uh, the page will actually appear. So the page which I actually made using Spark page is loaded. So everything is here just like this. As you can see, everything is functional. I click it, the gallery works. And people can view this as an actual website just like that quite easily. And you don't need HTML knowledge for this. That's the beauty of this. So another way to share it is via Facebook. You can click this to share via your Facebook feed, your Twitter uh, wall, even Google Classroom if you're using Google Classroom uh, to teach your students. And you can also email the link uh, to respective recipients. Uh, another thing you have is if you got an HTML knowledge, you want to embed uh, your, your HTML code into your, your website, you can click on this embed link right here. And over here, here's the HTML script, which you can copy and paste so that it seems as if um, this web page is a part of a bigger website. So these are the ways you can publish and export um, web, uh, web pages via Spark page. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.